Are you a Zionist? Yes. Why is your and United States at the current moment support for Israel so strong? If there weren't in Israel, every Jew in the world would be at risk. And so there's a need for it to be strong and a need for Israel to be able to have, after World War II, the ability for, the, the ability for Jews to have a place that was their own. That, but you don't have to be a Jew to be a Zionist. And the Zionist is about whether or not Israel is a safe haven for Jews because of their history of how they've been persecuted. Are you a Zionist? Yes. Do you know what a Zionist is? I just ask questions I don't answer. By the way, I'm the guy that did more for the Palestinian community than anybody. I'm the guy that opened up all the assets. I'm the guy that made that sure that I got the Egyptians to open the border to let good goods through, medicine and, and food and, I said, defensive weapons. I denied them offensive weapons that they were using, 2,000 pound bombs and the rest, to, because I made it real clear. They cannot use weapons that we provide them to, in fact, use in civilian areas. And that's why I put together this plan. By the measure of your support for Israel, why would a Muslim or an Arab American vote for you for re-election? Same reason why Arab Americans in the region support me. The same reason why, because it's the best way to keep peace, the best way to put things together, to make sure that there is a two-state solution in the region. And I've been a strong supporter of that. I've been able to work with the Arab countries very well. And uh, there's not, I don't have a prejudiced bone in my body. I, the Arabs are good people, they need help. <laughs>